I'm going to do some random pulls for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. In this exercise, we're going to focus on identifying the strength in a dealt hand, because that's the first step to picking a hand. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. We'll roll these dice to determine which player we are. I rolled a 10. 10 would be player 2. I'll get 13 tiles. We have a joker, a dragon, and an east, three dots, a bam, and lots of cracks with two multiples, four and six. If this were your dealt hand, what would you play and what would you pass? If this were my hand, I would play two, four, six, eight. I would just keep every two, four, six, eight Pick a hand when I run out of discards. I would discard those first in the first pass. If we get flowers, we could maybe even play the fourth hand down. Two, four, six, eight. The challenge is we have no flowers and that is a pair that's required for that hand. I've gone a whole game without drawing a flower. So I don't know if I would commit to that. I would gather and then when I run out of discards, pick a hand. No flowers is a weakness right now. If that would be the hand that's played. No flowers. That's why I wouldn't pick a hand. We could also play two, four, six, eight, eight. Concealed. Pung, pair, pung, pung, pung. There's a gap, but you can use jokers. No flowers required. We are going to be player two again. Joker, flower, west, green. Three dots, singles, three bams, singles, three cracks, singles, no multiples. There's a joker though, and even a flower. So if these were your tiles, what would you play and what would you pass? If this were my hand, I think I would play three, six, nine. I think that's what we have the most of. Five tiles to three, six, nine. We do have two nines, a flower. Maybe keep the green dragon because there is a three, six, nine hand with dragons that matches. Concealed pair of flowers, three, six, nine with dragons. So I think I would keep that. I think I would probably pass. Those three or maybe yeah, I think I would pass those three. 
you might think, well, why not pass an odd with an even? We'd be left with like numbers. If we get everything we want, we'd have to pass like numbers. So I'd rather break up those so I have a good set of tiles for the next pass. I'd pass those. We're going to be player four. Joker Flower News, three, five, seven, eight, singles, three, four, nine, singles. No multiples, but we have news. In essence, that's a block, single tiles. With this in mind, what would you play and what would be your first pass? If I were playing these tiles, I think I would either try for Winds and Dragons, Concealed News Hand, or maybe a Year Hand, or maybe the News Pair Hand with Threes. News Pair Hand with Threes, News Year Hand, maybe discard those. This, I think, would be the predominant pattern. I would build around news, whether it's a block of singles or build it up and play wins only, or wins with flowers. If you have a set of tiles at home, try random pulls. It's a great way to build your confidence in identifying the strength in a dealt hand. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next set of random pulls for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, May all your picks be keepers.